Hello and welcome, this is STR Rank, and today I'm playing some more Hogwarts Legacy on PC. Let's go ahead and hop in. Alright. Strangely, there wasn't any sound playing until I moved my controller a little bit. That's an interesting situation. Um, let's see. I think today I want to do a few quests and um, keep things moving along. First off, I want to see if there are any available side quest showing on the maps um so i think it'd be fun to pick one up if so all right let's go to hogwarts and it looks like there's something over here but it's just one of these uh normal ones so let's go back here just looking 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 um hmm. okay not seeing anything yet Oh, there's a bandit camp. All right. Keep just kind of flipping through here. Pretty sure it'd show up at this elevation if there was a quest marker. The tomb of treachery. All right, let's see. So I'm not seeing anything. There's an ancient power place over here, though. Okay. Well, I guess that's that. So let's go back to quest. And let's see. In the shadow of time, this is something... Oh, we get Imperio. I think we'll probably go for that. Yeah, let's do it. And let's do locate on map. Nice. There's no telling what lies in wait for me in there. All right. Catacomb. You're here. Good. Sebastian, that relic you mentioned? I believe one of Slytherin's students stumbled upon the relic during an assignment to study sarcophagi in this catacomb. From what I read in a report by the student, they weren't permitted to take it with them, so I must assume it's still here. As I mentioned earlier, this relic grants its holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. If it's in this catacomb, I have to find it. For Anne. I need to see her. I'd be interested to know what else the student discovered. Have a look. Unfortunately, there's no name on it. But I suspect if it was important enough for Slytherin to stash in his spellbook, it's worthy of further study. I'm ready to explore the catacomb. Perhaps we can visit Anne when we finished. Perfect. By the way, Ominous has been asking about you. You didn't tell him what we were doing, did you? I didn't. I promise. Good. Ominous would be livid if he knew what we were about to do. Student report. The catacomb assignment yielded more than I'd imagined. Learning about our ancestors is illuminating. However, I stumbled upon something else I could not ignore. The area behind the great room, which had suffered decay amid the turned over sarcophagi, I discovered an oddly shaped relic. Immediately I sensed its power. I'd be thrilled to study the relic further, if only the removal of objects were allowed. I'll be interested to compare what lies inside to what I've read about this catacomb. Hmm. I've never heard it pronounced catacomb. I've always heard catacomb, but that might be an American thing there. I'll freely admit. I'm sure that foul smell is the scent of success. Try not to lose your nerve just yet. Hmm. It's like a chamber back Rebellion. here. Rebellion. So I double check because this looks like. Good finger. Maybe not. Bombarder. Okay. Worth a try. Let's see. I don't know why the other one didn't blow up. Maybe I need to do this first. Incendio. 
Here we go. At least now we know we're not alone in here. Perhaps that's it. And the rest of the tomb will be insect free. Yeah, spiders aren't insects. Don't start. <laughs> we're here for a reason. I'd say opening them all is justified. Rebellion. Okay, so we need to get up there. Accio. Confirm. Aha. Accio. Oh, spiders. This room is taller than it looks. Incendio. Revelio. I wonder, actually, I think that's gonna advance it. I think we need to get up there to get our next uh, thingamabob. So. Watching it burn is pretty cool. Okay. Levioso. I thought I'd already go to Wingardium Liviosa, but apparently not. Let's uh, put that there. We'll do this. There we go. And we'll put you like this. There we go. Hopefully I can climb this. There we go. Revelio. Huh. Oh, there it is. Finding a chest in an inconspicuous loft. Brilliant. Strange. I'm hearing like a little whispering sound, but I don't actually see anything. Huh. We'll just keep moving forward. Use the pulso. Alright, where's our depulso? It's is it? We've read the world of another spider. Whoa. I shall sleep. Why at least die so quickly. That was strange. I don't understand. Maybe I'm just getting a little bit overpowered at this point. Hmm. Which way, which way? So that's the way we came. Revelio. Just want to look and see. Uh, that one has a lot of stuff in it, so maybe this way is a way to go. Watch your step. I nearly slipped there. Hmm. I almost thought they ran away. Burn, spiders burn. Okay. All this grass. It no longer feels like a tomb. Revelio. Learn about catacombs that underwent expansion efforts and ran into problems. Often cave-ins. Uh -huh. And then were abandoned. Exactly. We'll be fine though. Oh, there's something here. There you go. Twenty galleons I need them desperately. <laughs> Incendio. Alright. So I'm glad I went this way because now I'll know Rebellion. to kind of uh, double back and go the other way. Don't think there's anything else in here. So we'll go ahead and run up. Okay, I think it should be over here. Is that an Fury down there? No, it's a bunch of booms. Now this is the sort of great room I want to be buried in. Surrounded by grandeur. Grandeur and then some. Even an old... Accio! Bones. Lovely. Bones outside a sarcophagus. Seems odd. Hmm. Wonder if we'll find our way up there here in a minute. All right. So what's the dealio here? Wonder if I'm going to make another bone bridge like that one place. Probably so. It's all our bones. Rebellion. 
There's something here by the altar. Depulsive. Oops. We all can bring them. I wonder if this leads up to that treasure room that I was looking at earlier. It's like a We've could. made it this far, but clearly we have more to do. Don't worry, we'll get back to the quest in a minute. <laughs> ah. Interesting. Is this going to be making a bone bridge? I guess we'll go ahead and do it. Accio. I need to find a safe way across. Hmm. It's just a little bit curious as far as... Not sure how it's gonna work. Lumos. Ah, I can light these fires. That'll help. Confringo. Incendio. There we go. Confringo. There we go. I'll make it recede. Accio. Now we can get our bones. Boom bones. Okay. Now we'll crawl back up. And here comes our bone fire. So creepy. Rickety bone bridge complete. Rebellion. Let's see, where is this going to lead us to? Uh. All right, now let's see. Accio. Is that going to open the door? Yep. An elegant emerald robe. Rebellion. Is that everything? Oh. Here's some more galleons. Oh, and one more treasure. Nice. Okay. There's another chamber over there. I think I'd like to take it too. We're in the tomb. I assume eerie sounds come with the territory. <laughs> That's a funny piece of dialogue. I think I heard him use that one before. Rebellion. Okay. More bones. I guess we're going to use it for our bone ladder here or something. Let's see what happens when we examine this note. I foolishly mentioned the relic in my report and was reminded to leave it where it lay. But research must come before my fealty to the rules. I sense something about this relic. I was told that those chosen by English oak wands have powerful intuition. I believe it. Therefore, when no one was looking, I acted. Conjure two barricades to isolate the relic. Ancestors forgive me, but I used their very bones as the key. I plan to return to it, but first I must ready myself for our next assignment, learning the Imperius Curse. Spell says serve well against what did enemies. You find? Looks like part of a student's diary. It mentions plans to return for the relic and conjuring barricades using bones. Of course. The student's summary referenced the space beyond the great room, which means this can't be a dead end. Let's divide and conquer. You work on sorting out the bone barricades. I'll look around and see what we missed. Hold on to that diary entry. There may be more to it. It does mention something else. It says their next assignment was learning the Imperius curse. Really? Interesting. We need to focus on moving beyond this room. But let me think for a moment. Do you think the pages were left here on purpose? Slytherin mentioned a student who excelled in charms and always carried a satchel stuffed full of notes. They might have been left on purpose, or the student may have simply dropped them. Of course. I'll start to search for those barricades. Brilliant. There's more to this than even I imagined. Look, bones stacked oddly on either side of this archway. 
Hmm. Leave no stone unturned. Or in this case, no bone. Okay. There you are. Come on, bones. Oh, that's pretty creepy. Mm, looks like we need even more bones for this sick key. <laughs> You've done it. I knew we'd get through. I felt it in my bones. Nice. Hey, at least the bones are being used for something, you know? Before we trudge on further, I've just realized something. The student's diary mentions the Imperious Curse. I wouldn't be surprised if we're going to need it here. It's an unforgivable, but useful when you're outnumbered. Places the victim completely under the caster's control. So, if you'd like to learn Imperio, I can teach you. We know I'm going to. Where did you learn the Imperius curse? I taught myself. Don't tell Ominous that I've told you. It's not exactly something I can brag about, but it may come in handy. I think you ought to know it. Shouldn't I know more about what the curse entails? Remember the blasting curse? Same idea, except when it comes to unforgivable curses, your intention has to be clear. You have to mean it. It's probably wise to know the spell. I couldn't agree more. A spell that could save your life shouldn't be unforgivable. You have a lot at stake. You have an ability that evidently no one's seen for centuries. Focus your wand movement. It's not an easy spell to master. All right, here we go. All right, looks like a triangle, square, circle, X. Ah, it looks kind of like a or. Yeah, that is pretty intricate. Here we go. Something troubling ahead. Be on your guard. Okay, let's uh put it in here with our other stuff. Typically forces enemies to fight as if they were your companion. While under your control, they take reduced damage from other enemies to prolong their allegiance to you. Also, curses the victim and curse victims take extra damage. Rebellion. Okay, so he's wanting up there. There we go. There we go. Okay, nice. Let's see, we got a big old spider web here. Mm -hmm. Although the sound effect of the rest of it catching on. Alright, let's see. So, I don't think we were going to be able to go that way. Got a door and a bunch of spiders. Check out the door path first, I suppose. Looks like it's just maybe a Another chamber. Barricade. Considering how well you did on the last one, this should be a cinch. <laughs> how gracious of you. I okay. try. I'm guessing this side is the one that we're intended to go to first. Gather some of the bones. Oh, that's a big old spider. Oh yeah, I'm having a big guy fight with this, to be honest. What's this guy doing? Uh oh. Okay, let's see. 
bit dramatic, isn't it? <laughs> All right. Incendio. Confringo. Oh, it is Incendio. not burning. Weird. Oh, uh, that's not good. We've encountered a glitch here. Hmm, what is this? Wigan well? Nice. It's been Rebellion. quite a little adventure. Got a new spell and all kinds of stuff to find. Uh, let's see. Now the question here is, is where else do we had to go? Um, this here's the treasure. Just as the student summary described. I doubt anyone's been here in quite some time. Alright. Another goodie. Look forward to identifying these things and seeing what I've got. Alright. So hopefully this is the one we're in now. Confringo. Mm, that's not good. Ah, there we go. That had to have been a glitch though, surely. Rebellion. Let's see, are we just come in here for bones or I'm gonna need some goodies here too. Aha, here's another one. Okay. Um Yeah. I don't think that there were any other bones, so let's just go up over here and see what we need to do. Alright. It's like Tetris pieces. Ah, some sort of puzzle. Let's see. Now that one did come out on its own. I wonder what's the correlation here. So maybe we have to pair them. So this one with the uh, other one. There we go. That worked. Keep going. Okay. Now let's see the uh, little Tetris logo thing along with this one. Oops. Alright, I get some bones. It's progress. And let's see the little knot thing there. And this guy. Looks like we'll have one more after this, too. Oh, present. Ah, oh, this is wooden well. Darn. Alright, the Tetris thing and the circle bob. Excellent. All right, bone door, open you up. Are head and shoulders above these bones. Nicely done. Okay. Revelio. I see why Slytherin's student was so entranced with this place. It's not quite the aesthetic. Once a transformed enemy with the pulse. Okay, let's uh get that going. Do transformation here. Oh. Way too long, it got smashed. Let's try again. If I want to get this other feet. Here we go. <laughs> Here 
Yeah, I'm trying to big eyes out of this. I'm gonna focus on the other big eye. I just need to take the big gun. <laughs> oh, that was brutal. That did never end. Nice. Rebellion. Confringo. All right. Rebellion. I think we collected everything along the way. Alright, I think it, that's everything along the way. Um, let's see. Dead end. Lovely. All that for nothing. Hold on. Don't give up yet. And that was just wing of belt, okay. Revelio. Anything else? Do you still see some items back here? That, that's a burn bridge. It could be wig and weld potion too. Okay. Oh, that's creepy. Relic contains abundant potential. Its possibilities could be not only wizard kind, but the world. But the dark sacrifice involved to realize its intent may be too great. Till we know more, please do not remove the relic. Sebastian, the relic. Look. Could it be? The note and rendition of the relic. It matches. This must be where the student left the relic. I can't believe it. After all this, it lines up. We've really found it. What do you suppose is meant by the dark sacrifice required to realize the relic's potential? I have no idea, but we're here for the relic. I'm willing to ignore what the journal entry says. We're taking the relic. Agreed. This is meant to be. For Anne's sake, I'm taking it. Let's get to Feldcroft. I must... Ominous! The sounds we kept hearing. It was you! Uh-oh. We're gonna have to fight Ominous here. I'm sorry, Ominous, but I'm taking it. Hold on, both of you. Sebastian, please, take a step back. Fine, but Ominous knows I won't step back from a fight. I can't believe this. How much did you hear? Everything. I heard you encourage Sebastian to take the relic. Sebastian's done his research. He knows what he's doing. Sebastian makes things sound easy when they could be impossible or dangerous. We need to stop him. And if nothing will change his mind? Something has to. I need your help. Sebastian's right. We need that relic. I'm sorry. My mind is made up. Are you willing to sacrifice your friendship over this? I might be. How could I choose to stand by and watch him do this? What if the choice wasn't yours? You wouldn't be to blame for what happens. What in the world are you suggesting? Imperium! Hmm. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go dark here. That's what I'm saying. I would take all responsibility. This could save your friendship. I know how to cast it. Sebastian taught me. But I won't do it unless you agree. This is insanity! I can't believe you would ask this of me. Sebastian is never going to give up trying to cure Anne. If you try and stop him now, he'll never forgive you. I'm... I... Fine. This is unfathomable. But I suppose if you want that responsibility, it may just save what is left of... of my friendship with Sebastian. Remember, this is what I was telling you about the Dark Arts. They come with a cost. You may well regret making this choice. Do what you have to do. Cast it. Before I change my mind. Imperio! Step aside, Ominous. 
Stay in place until we're out of sight. I will. Sebastian, come on. What did you do? Imperio, it was the only way to get out of here without a fight. Ominous, I'm sorry. Sebastian, we have to go. Well, there we go. Pretty sad. You do the wrong thing. You need the relic. I know. But not like this. Ominous and I agreed. Surely there's a difference between casting Imperial on someone without their knowledge and casting it with permission. I understand what you're saying. I do, but... I've taken full responsibility. You have my word. Hmm, wonder why you can't keep up. This area had some weird issues, that whole part the ominous you couldn't hear when talking and without the uh, subtitles that would have dunk. Oh shoot, I did make a loop. Thought I realized something was wrong a minute ago. Um It's actually meant to go out this way. I think. <laughs> Maybe. No. There we go. Yeah, here we are. How long would the spell last? How long must Ominous stay in the tomb? The curse is lifted already. He'll easily find his way out of the catacomb just as we did. He'll be all right, Sebastian. I don't know. He let a blind student in with a bunch of, you know, spiders. Like, ah, oh, you gotta run out. Darn. It's bizarre. It won't let me fly. Uh-oh, looks like a fire. When we get to Feldcroft, I'd rather Anne not know what had to be done to get this relic. She thinks like ominous, but it only upset her. I don't see myself doing this sort of thing forever, though. Fancy I'll have my own operation worked out one day. People working for me. Oh, no, this isn't good. What is it? Smoke, over there, by the hamlet. Feldkopf's in trouble. They're under attack. Let's hurry. Here we go. I've been fighting this before you were born. Was that your best? Bring Okay, let's see. We have Bombarda. We'll do it down here. Loyal is similar while they charge her magic. Get loyal with Sentinel. Oh, loyal with Sentinel. That's a new one. Hmm. 
<laughs> nice. Oh, whoa, dang. Who did that? That must be an oilist commander. Oh, that's an sentinel. There we go. Sorry about that, buddy. You can set you on fire. Unforgivable curse from that damn book, no doubt. Your father would be ashamed. You've gone too far, Sebastian. Stay away from her. From all of us. <laughs> what did my uncle expect me to do? The Imperious Curse saved Anne's life. That goblin was going to kill her. You did what you had to do. If I have to keep proving that to my uncle, I will. He cannot banish me from my own home. From my sister. It might be best to let him calm down a while. May I speak to him? Perhaps I can help to ease the tension a bit. You may be right. Very well. Probably best if I get away from here for a while. I'll head back to Hogwarts. Well, that was intense. Rebellion. They drop any other loot. Oh, there's one. I think that's where the major was. It looks like there's something in this pumpkin. Nice. Come on, Solomon. Stop being such a square. What was he thinking? Pardon me, Mr. Sallow. What Sebastian did was inexcusable. You cannot possibly be about to defend him. Sebastian and I have encountered Ranrock's loyalists before. That goblin would have killed Anne. This family does not resort to using dark magic, even against our enemies. What Sebastian did cannot be undone. That you are defending Sebastian's behavior at all tells me everything I need to know. You are as guilty as he is. Sebastian is to come nowhere near Feldcroft, nowhere near Anne. Unforgivable curses are so named for a reason. If I hear that either of you continues down this path, if either of you uses dark magic, I will notify the headmaster immediately. Why, Sebastian? Boy, you made me so frustrated with that situation. I about used the Crucio on him too. Jeez. Let's see what Anne has to say about it. Nope. Ah. This might be interesting. Can we read it now? Huh. Just want to go through the list just to make sure I don't miss it, but I'm guessing I need to deliver it to Sebastian. Oh yeah, 
I never did spend my talent point. Um, let's look at our dark arts here. Curses other targets with each successful strike. Mm, that's kind of nice. Um, spells. And explosive objects. Um, I think I might go ahead and do that one. We're about to level up again soon anyway, so that'll be fun. Okay, um, let's see. Shadow of Distance, Speak with Sebastian. And yeah, I'll go do that um, now. I think that the end part, I'll swing back to um, the uh, room of requirement. I'm not exactly sure how to get to the Undercroft. Um, I feel like... It might not have its own warp area. Let me uh, just do track quest. I feel like it's close, but like it's not named, so it's hard for me to remember exactly where it is. It's gotta be this warp though. Yeah, outside of the Dada classroom. All right, down the stairs and over this way. Did you speak with my uncle? I wish I had better news about your uncle and Anne. Well? What did he say? I'm afraid he wants you nowhere near Feldcroft. Nor Anne. I had to stop that goblin from killing my sister. He had no right to banish me from my own twin. <sighs> if he thinks banishing me means I'm going to give up on Anne, he's sorely mistaken. He also said he cannot excuse the use of dark magic in any form. And that if he hears of either of us using it, he'll go straight to Professor Black. Huh? That relic, dark magic or not, is the key to saving Anne. To reverse that curse. I will not lose Anne for good. I should send the crest to Anne. She'll know that we need to meet. I'm afraid I don't follow. Nothing, just a thought. Now I'm more determined than ever to learn what power that relic has. What did you mean you'd send Anne a crest so that she'd know to meet you? It's... We just lost our parents, and we were packing up to go and live with Solomon. We couldn't take everything. She was carefully organizing her prized possessions, a box of artifacts she'd collected to do with our family. Jewelry, cards, old photographs. She got to her favorite, a handmade crest, and without a second thought, she handed it to me. This will keep you safe, she said. It holds no enchantment, but I've kept it with me since. That's how I can reach Anne. I'll get the crest to her with plans to meet. Be careful, Sebastian. Your uncle could intercept it. We'll be expelled. Even if Ominous is upset with us, he has no love lost for his family. He'd use their connections to the Headmaster if we needed his help. I shall wait to hear from you then. Thank you. I very much appreciate you standing by me through all of this. I'll send you an owl when I have news. Hmm, okay. Well, I guess that's it for now. Let's uh, go to our room of requirement. Oops, secret rooms. There we go. I think we'll do a round of everything and probably call it a stream for the day since we got us another quest done. It's actually a pretty involved one. Um, I was surprised. It was good though. A charcoal, a charcoal lock scarf. Okay, let's try using our invisibility potion up. Unfortunately, I can't use up. Oh, there's our wiggle. Okay. And 
I'll double check, but I'm pretty sure we're not having an upgrade on any of the stuff we picked up. Oh, man, we're so close to leveling up too. That'd be nice to get. And silent mask looks pretty cool. Dark sun hat. Okay. What about our outfit? Okay, looks like this about everything can be sold. So we'll do a round of our singers or stuff. We'll go sell. And we'll probably call a stream after that. Let's see. Oh, there's this focus potion. I'm already full, I suppose. I barely used any of my plants in the previous fight, so definitely getting strong. I just didn't even use a potion either, so I need to remember to use them up. Okay. Real little test roll. Okay, unicorn. Toad. Okay, top of the. Come on, toad. Guessing the unicorn's already had its food. Yep. Alright, everybody has had their stuff. Okay, let's go to the other vivarium that's up here. And we're gonna scrub brush them. Saints aren't ready to be interacted with. There you go. Okay. Oh, what are they getting food already? Yep. They sure are. I wish it were a little bit easier to target a particular one. Oh, I guess you just have to do it like you're aiming a spell. Okay. Alright, come on little moon calf. There we go. Okay, what about this guy? So many mouths to feed, so many tummies to scritch. All right. Back in here. Okay. Come on, little flooper. <laughs> Look at that pusky, though. Okay, 
We got a post game we need to collect from. It's the shiny one. And what else? Um, wow. I feel like that was the fastest harvest run I've had in maybe ever. Like, it's crazy. All right. Now, let's work back to Hogsmeade and sell off our stuff. And we will clear out our inventory screens and probably call it a stream after that. Come on in. Healing potions are a speciality here, should you need any. All right. That one's actually an upgrade, so we'll save it. Can't believe I'm on the way to 25,000 galleons. I always felt like I'm going to take Thank forever again to for delivering those save up. To save me a lot of time and trouble. These look pretty funny. They look almost like googly eyes. <laughs> And increased damage with Kushio. I mean, that'd be fun. I hope to see you again. Okay. Well for now. So let's see what we have in our menus here and what we can clear off. So I have nine more enemy types to run into. Okay, that may have been it. So let's see, we got everything cleared off our map. So I'm curious to see what's on our owl post. You know, I don't think these are ordered. Well, I don't know. Let's see, what does Rona say? I can't remember if I've already done that one or not. Surely I did. I think I would have had a quest marker if I hadn't. Um, so yeah, that's, I think that's probably a wrap for today. So we still have this dragon debrief thing to do and mom's a word. And I think I'll clear out those maybe in the next stream. I'm kind of debating on how much longer I want to play the game overall. And, um, you know, there's still plenty of points of interest. Um, but, you know, so many of them are just feeling a bit repetitive. Like, I do want to try to get a decent number of these cleared before, you know, calling it a day and just seeking out completing the main story. But, you know, they're, they're just so time consuming. So, I don't know. We'll see how it goes next couple of streams and probably make a decision, you know, soon. So, now let's go ahead and... Roll the credits to say thank you for watching. It's been S Tier Inc. Follow me on Mastodon, Twitch, and YouTube. I'll have an upload on YouTube soon. Thanks. Bye.